David, um, 2010, wonderful memories of South Africa hosting. Tell us about that. I mean, for me, it's the best year uh, as a football player in my in my career. The memories are always great. Everybody that talking about South Africa take me back to to the 2010 memories, and it was great. It was the best moment in my career. Yeah. Lost your first game. How did you bounce back to go on to lift the title? It was difficult these days because we didn't expect to lose the, the first game. We we come to South, Afri South Africa with uh, good results in the in the last game, and we didn't expect to, to lose against Switzerland. But that happened in the in the World Cup. The good thing was there is that we have time to recovery this lose of the of the first game because we were, we were in the phase of, of group, and after that we we took the the trophy. The African countries have been doing better in the second round of games. Have any of them impressed you? Cameroon, uh, Morocco, Senegal? I think Ghana play play very well. You know, every team are playing are playing well. I, I am not disappointed with any team in the in the in the World Cup right now. Obviously, in in football, it's, there is one team that win and there is one team that lose. But I think the way that they are playing all uh, are are well. But if you ask me for the African teams, uh, I think Ghana Ghana are playing very well. Yeah. If we look through the the different. Uh, team today. Um, the Spanish side, tell me what you've made of them so far. Obviously great against Costa Rica, also very good against Germany, very young side as well. Just how is your, what is your assessment? I'm very happy. I'm very happy. I'm very proud that the way that they are playing. Uh, they, are, they did two great games, uh, obviously the first one with uh, uh, seven nil, uh, but in the second one against Germany, um, it was good. I was in the stadium. I think Spain played very well, 65, 70 minutes. After that, Germany was a little bit in the last minute, a little bit better, and, and he and he scored the draw. But um, I'm I'm very happy. They are playing well, and I am very confident with the way that Spain is is playing. And then just obviously the next challenge is against Japan. What what kind of um, what are your expectations for ah. this? Difficult game, difficult game because Japan is a team that is very strong. Uh, they run a lot. They are so uh, people that fighting until the last minute. Uh, physically, they are they are they are strong because they have the, the capacity. But I believe that Spain, if uh, if they will do the same that they did in the in the first two games, can have chance to win in the game and, and go to the next stage. David, until your team as a player, Spain didn't win, any, didn't win anything. And then you're winning the Euro, the World Cup. What happened? Because this is football and it's difficult to win. Um, uh, when you go to the World Cup or the Euro Cup, uh, just one team can win and the other lose in this case. And it's difficult to win. Uh, Spain win three t titles in a row in a short term, but was many years without nothing. So I don't say it is normal, but it's very difficult to win. Your and we need to special. realize this. Yeah. Your team was very special. Yeah, we have good moment, good time. Uh, we play very well. Yeah. We're from Israel. Did you get to see Chaim Revivo, Dudu Awat? Did you know them? Yeah, Revivo. Yeah, I think I never play against him because I am a little bit younger than him. But yeah, yeah, I remember him when he played in the Liga. And Awate also? Awate to do Awate? Oh yeah, uh, against Awate uh, I play against, yeah, yeah. I probably score uh, sometimes against him, yeah. <laughs> David, um, asking a general question about the profile of the games because of five subs and 74 minutes extra time with the, yeah. <laughs> the injury time. Firstly, as a striker, would you have liked to be involved in, in games like this because it seems that so many attacking options and it's it's harder for the defenders. What's what's your assessment? Yeah, obviously. I, in general, I I am not talking about the the attacking side or defending side. In general, I am I am watch. I, I like the, the the way that I am watching the the games. I think the the, the teams are playing well. Uh, no defending. The people want to attack. All the teams want to attack. Um, and I am, I am happy. I don't know if I, if I enjoy it more at this time with more extra time or something like that. Because before, when I was playing, or no extra time like 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 today, I, I don't want to say nothing uh, about it. But 
I, I am enjoying the way that they are playing, not just in attacking, uh, obviously in, in defense too. Is there enough creativity or does, do you feel that athleticism and, and cause everyone is Olympic athletes out there. No. That, that kind of both. negates the creativity. I think both. Football improves uh, in all the ways, you know, not just physically, that, that's it. It's, it's true that the players now physically are stronger than years ago because they take care more than the, the body than 20 years ago. But even in tactics, uh, you have technology, you know, you, you can study better the, the rival, um, even the quality, because you have <laughs> technology also for, for improve the quality. So the football is improving, uh, as always, and in 10 years we'll improve the, 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 this time uh, now. Uh, I think in, everything of the, in, in every part of the game they are improving, yeah. Who do you think will win the World Cup? I hope Spain, yeah, for sure, 100%. <laughs>